right after March break. That's when COVID started in 2020. And there was still a bit of snow. So I would bring my shovel to the field, dig myself just a big enough area so I could juggle and move around. And I'm training like three, four hours every single day. I'm spending more time training than I am playing. I mean, pretty much any athlete in any sports doing that, right? If you don't invest time properly into what you want to do, how do you expect to perform? You know, because at the end of the day, in life, you realize even if I make it to the highest level and I'm not happy, I'm sad, what does it matter? All that matters is that I feel fulfilled. If you like what you are doing, then training with it becomes fun. Sports have always been a huge part of my life. I knew that Concordia didn't have a rowing team, but that didn't stop me from wanting to compete uh, at the competitions and all of that. Basically, I had to start uh, my own team in order to represent Concordia at competitions. I did everything for it, and um, that basically allowed me to go to like all these different regattas. want to do something, you have to go out there and do it yourself. Even though it's a lot of work and time and effort, but once you do it, it's like an accomplishment on its own. The 1% better every day, it, it's not something that is new. For me, it's a, a bigger belief. You tell any athletes, hey, would you want to improve by 1%? They all say yes on the spot. Where there might be a change is that, can you say yes every day? Basketball is my first love. I don't think there's a day where I'm going to wake up saying I don't love basketball or I don't love this game. You know, you go through a bit of adversity as, as you get older and you realize that the game is always going to be there. Even to this day, there's moments where I end up in a gym with a basketball and I, I just get to shoot, to play for an hour or two. Basketball, it kind of becomes your world. It, like You make it your own world. There are days where you wake up and you don't want to go to practice. Like It's easy to come up with excuses, but discipline is like the most important thing. Everyone in the world has a passion. You realize, damn, I can do this for hours, and then the training becomes fun. Soccer or any other sport or any other craft is just one method of expressing you. Now that I'm done, you kind of look back and you realize that it was just... It's not even about the sport, it's just about, you know, the athlete or the individual trying to become its best version of itself. You know, for some it's sports, for others it's going to be theater, it's going to be journalism, it's going to be a specific job, you know, the ultimate quest is about, you know, getting 1% better every day and just finding ways to improve every single day. <laughs> 